In this episode, I got Mr. Graydon Bird, a fellow TLC, fellow, fellow, fellow team member. Oh, yeah. Well, with that introduction, Graydon, I how love, are you? I'm doing well with my new title there. Get your new title? Yeah. Rocking and rolling. So what's going on with all this heat? Welcome, everybody, back to another episode of the Bob Carr Show. In this episode, I got Mr. Graydon Bird, a fellow TLC team member. So what's going on with all this heat? Um, a lot of installs. A lot of people need irrigation. It's very hot out. Um, everybody's sweating every day because, you know, it's 100 degrees outside. You boys drinking a lot of water now, aren't you? Uh, yeah. Going through a case of water a week at least. A case of water a week? <laughs> What's one of the challenges now that we're done with spring and you're into the summer roll and it's hot out with your camera gear, the guys, the gals? One of them kind of is a year round thing. It's just getting the guys and gals to wear the head mounts and focus on setting up the tripods for me, but they're more oriented to show up at the job site, sure. get it planned out. So they're trying to get started. their job done. Yeah. The camera gear to them is like, oh, I'm helping Graydon now. I'm helping out Mr. Bob, but in their mind, that's not their priority. Which, which I understand, right? I'm sure you do too. It's frustrating though when you're trying to get some video shot for for a teaching episode and they're not cooperating. But it's not like they're trying to do it to you. Yeah, they're not, not cooperating. They're just focused on yep. other things and they forget about it most of the time. So it's yeah. not that much of an issue um, until it's summertime now and I've got five installs a day that I need to bounce around between. What challenges you're seeing with folks with their lawns this time of year? A lot of them, if they added plants if they got landscaping done after we came in for the spring startup or they they were on the schedule for July and their lawns are starting to die. They're Some of the yards are under stress right now? Yeah. Okay. Our customers have midsummer tune-ups either in their service plan or just scheduled one separately from that. So there's no issues there. All the water is properly adjusted. They added a flower bed. They changed their lawn in some way and we adjusted for that. The customers that haven't done that are starting to see some dry spots in their lawn where the grass is dying or those flowers that they just bought are now starting to die and it's frustrating for them i got you but we can obviously help them with that yeah they just got to reach out and say hey i need yeah. some help here we can adjust or add sprinkler heads as needed so as customers come up and ask me these questions about lawns what can be done about it i'd usually just tell them to call the office that's what you prefer right the easiest way absolutely having this call the office here at 410-721-2342 and someone in the service department will set up a service call for them we can come out and take a look and if we need to add time to the controller duration or frequency add another day or two a week we can do that for them and that way their plants that are a yard it's not struggling great and i appreciate you coming into the studio today spending a couple minutes with us always can afford some time out of my day to come help you guys out thank you sir and this wraps up another episode of the bob carr show if you like this hit the subscribe button below and we'll talk to you next week this wraps up another episode of the bob carr show if you like this subscribe below and we'll talk to you next week on another episode of the bob carr show